Hi, and welcome to the show. This is family friendly. Mm. Another week, another 3MJ. Okay, it's Friday. Don't look away. I mix the news like a mother DJ. Subscribe because I want to get a Hyundai. Hyundai? Yeah, Hyundai. Because, you know, they're nice and I heard they're not that expensive and I couldn't find rhyme for Lamborghini. So, yeah, it's your boy. Little shit. Mm. Yeah, sorry about that. I, I, it's, it's a thing that I have to get out once in a while, you know. It, sorry. Welcome again to Swimmy John. <laughs> And now the news. A chatbot therapist. Artificial intelligence is taking over everything. Self-driving cars, personal assistants, toys, and now we have an online therapy chatbot. Uh, Mr. Three Minutes. Yes? The doc will see you now. It's called Wobot. Hello, I'm a Wobot. It was created by a team of Stanford psychologists and AI experts. Uh, fancy. It uses brief daily chat conversations, mood tracking, and word games to help people deal with their mental health. Doc, I, I have a problem. It's okay, you can tell me. I, I don't know what's real anymore, you know, I... I don't know if Kim Kardashian's ass is real or fake. <laughs> this is a common problem for so many people, John. It uses Facebook Messenger to chat with you. It insists that it will not ask about your childhood or other embarrassing stuff. Because it's a bot and it cannot replace a real therapist. But reviews say that it does make you feel better. As privacy goes, Wobot doesn't look at your Facebook profile or newsfeed, it only gets your name, gender and time zone. But this being on Messenger, Facebook can see the content of your conversations. So yeah. Thanks, Mark. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> hey. Sorry I'm late. F***ing <laughs> Facebook. Don't mind me. It's free for the first two weeks, and then it will cost $39 per month. Well, a therapist is way more expensive, but then again, for $39, you can buy two grams of therapy. I feel great. <laughs> but hey, if you're feeling down and don't care that Facebook sees your conversations, maybe Wobot can help. Mr. Three Minutes, your main problem is that you have very few YouTube subscribers. It all makes sense now. Yeah, you should come to Facebook. Zuckerberg is our great leader. Xbox gets another X. Another way to resolve your mood problems are video games. Because nothing relaxes a stress mind like slicing Templars in Assassin's Creed, or flying a stolen car in GTA V, or killing chickens in Minecraft. After months of speculation, Microsoft unveiled the new Xbox. It's the smallest one so far, and it's called Xbox One X. Xbox already has two Xs. If it had one X, it would be Xbo or Box. And Xbox One X has three Xs. Just like Tom Cruise. And why the hell am I talking about Xs? I don't know. I must be going crazy. I just might. The doc will see you now. Anywho, the console will ship with 6 teraflops of graphical power, where its main competitor, the PS4 Pro, has only 4.2 teraflops. What the f*** is a teraflop? I don't quite understand what flops are, but they say the more the merrier. Are teraflops like huge flip-flops? Its custom GPU engine is a big increase from the Xbox One and even the PS4 Pro. It will have an Ultra HD Blu-ray drive for the 4K movies and entertainment, and 1 terabyte of storage. The new Xbox One X will be launched worldwide on November 7th, and it will cost $500. It's $100 more than the PS4 Pro, but then again, it's the most powerful console in the world. I mean, it has like six huge flip-flops. I like Xbox, I like PS4, but I just love an old school Nintendo. Never forget my boy Mario. Yo, Mario! Mario! Malware and ransomware for Macs. If you feel protected with your MacBook or iMac just because it's Apple and you paid a shit load of money for it, you can now panic. Hackers have developed a malware called MacSpy, a ransomware called MacRansom, and a recipe called Mac and Cheese. Okay, not the last one, but the first two are real. Mmm, Mac and Cheese. The beauty of it is that hackers won't use them personally to hack your Macs. They are programs that can be bought so that anyone could hack your Mac OS. God damn! Do you want to hack your ex-girlfriend but she has a MacBook? Ah, <sighs> damn it. It's impossible. Not anymore. Get our new MacSpy and you could see Everything. Wow! Now I can be a creepy stalker! MaxPy! The MaxPy can capture a screenshot of the victim's computer every 30 seconds, it records every keystroke entered, like logging credentials, it can access the microphone and even your photos on iCloud. And the MacRansom will encrypt and block your files until you pay the attacker $700 worth of Bitcoin. Damn!
So remember to keep regular backups of your data, always update and patch your systems, get protection software, and stop acting so smug just because you own a Mac. You know better. Okay, maybe just a little. I'm gonna spy on your Mac, so you better have respect. Oh, just got hacked. Cut, cut the beat, man. Cut, cut the beat, man. Cut. Mom! This is the show. Thanks again for watching. Remember to subscribe if you haven't. Leave a comment below. I'm pointing at my d Doesn't matter. I'm John. Until next week. Keep it safe and secure. Cheers. Yeah, it's your boy, little shit. Ha ha. Yeah.